Thanks for checking out this unboxing video, and this is the September Bambox Horror unboxing. Um, if you can hear that, rustling. It sounds like something's kind of jingling, like a jingle bell type thing. Um, I don't know how I feel about that. I don't really remember what the uh, franchises slash properties are that are supposed to be in this. It's been a while. I also feel like I haven't done like a, a Bambox unboxing in a while. This is like a little, nah, no, this is actually about on time. The regular box, or as they're calling it, I think the pop culture is what they're calling it now. Um, that one is a little bit delayed, but I should be getting it within the next few days, I believe. So apparently they had another hold up with their prop replica, which happened before, but you know. So, going to get into this September BAM horror. Tissue paper for the cat. She'll be excited. Oh, three pieces. Of, ooh, all right. Three pieces this time. I like it when it's three. Mm, there's something kind of heavy. Oh, it feels like it might be a necklace of sorts. No, it's not. What is this? I don't know what this is from. It's like a key. Hmm, 64 is what it says on it. I mean, it's quality, like these usually are. These usually are good quality. 64, and it looks the same on both sides there. It's got this chain. It's got like this tassel to it. And then it's got like this C, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what this is from. I don't, it doesn't ring a bell. That doesn't ring a bell at all. It's very heavy, though, like is normal with any sort of metal type uh, props they do. They're they're always heavy and, and like quality, but it's, I mean, it's quality. I just don't know what it is. I'll have to see the spoiler sheet. Oh, did I get all the pins? Oh, okay. So I had been, actually, now I'm remembering, I've been told that I got an upgrade. I think they told me that I got an art upgrade, but I guess maybe I got a pin upgrade for this? Um, cause I feel three pins right now. So honestly, I'm totally good with that. Yeah. As we can see, I got my one up, um, cause I won, won a contest. So maybe I get all the upgrades like art and pins. I'd be fine with that too. I don't know, but I'm excited. I feel three pins in there because you know, I'm all about the pins. Love the pins. I, lo I really like the, 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 um, pieces of art too, typically, but all right. What order should I, I'm going to look at them before showing them to you. So I can do them in, like, order of rarity. Okay. Oh, I'm not going to know. Oh, no, I do know it says there. Okay. So first, now I remember what this one property was. So Universal Monsters was actually one of the properties, which I think is cool because a lot of the more the stuff they've been doing has been within the past few decades. Um, so to really, like, reach back and go with horror roots, it's really cool. Um, so when I saw Universal Monsters was one of the properties, I remember being like, oh, that's a good idea. I like that. So we have a Dracula. I mean, it doesn't really look like a, like a Lugosi Dracula or anything, but I mean, it's a Dracula. I like the purple. I mean, decent design. Yeah. I mean, it looks good. That's the normal one. The, uh, the one out of 250, this looks even better, to be honest. Actually... All right, well, I'm not going to say that right now. I'll say that later. But this looks even better than that one. I like this one. So this is out of 250. Only 250 is done. Uh, the Frankenstein. That Frankenstein looks really nice. That's a nice, like, kind of pukish green, like pea puke green, which, you know, suits the Frankenstein mold. Uh, no, like the sculpting on, well, it's not really sculpting, but the design of that pin just looks really good. That's really nice. I like this one a lot. Uh, the Dracula's cool, but it seems like a little more, I don't know, it kind of looks like a little generic, the face does, whereas the the Frankenstein one, or Frankenstein's monster, technically, um, is, is very, like, iconically shaped. There's a lot more going on. I like that. And then the out of 99, this one's cool, too, although... I think I like the Frankenstein the most, but this one is cool too. Out of 99, Wolfman, like old school friggin' Wolfman. Who's it? Paul Nashi, Nashi, who originally played Wolfman and Frankenstein's monster was Boris Karloff. Um, 
See, now I'm curious. I'm always curious. Like, what number out of 99 did I get? What number out of 250 did I get? What's this one? Nine. Oh, 82. 82 out of 99. So that's cool. I know some people probably out there are just like, I don't care. Just keep going with the box. But I know there are some people who probably care as well. So you can fast forward if you need to, others. And this one is 146 out of 250. That Frankenstein's cool, though. I really like the Frankenstein. Now I'm I still don't know what that key is from. Okay, so here we go. Uh, fan art collection art print. This one is by Lab Creature, is the name of the artist. Um, oh, this is their one-year anniversary box. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. And this is Michael Myers. That's, that's kind of interesting. So this is the uh, this is a one of the special ones. This is out of five hundred. This is number three eighty two out of five hundred. I like the design of it. Like it looks cool, but Michael Myers looks a little weird because he looks skinny. Like I don't I I don't think he you know he looks he looks larger and beefier to me in the movies. And for him to like look skinny like this, like you see like his face looks kind of skinny. His neck looks very skinny. Um, but I like, you know, like, the knives up here and the pumpkins. Like, I love the style and, like, the little blood splatter going on here. Like, it looks good. I like it. It's just the skinniness is throwing me off because I just don't think of Michael Myers that way at all. Like, he's, like, a bigger, burly, beefy type dude. But that's cool. The next one, yeah. And then here's the other art one. Oh, damn, I should have I should have done these in order of rarity. Oh, well, sorry. Um, is this the regular one? Yeah, this is the regular one. So this is out of, I got number 111 out of 2,000. I believe this is a regular one. It's the same thing, except this one's color. So, honestly, yeah, let me show you. I, I kind of like, well, I don't know. I was going to say for a second that I kind of like the color one a little bit more, but I don't, I actually don't think that's true when I think about it more. As you can see, between these two. Check it out. Someone's at my door, but I'm going to finish this up. Um, yeah, so check that out. The color versus the non-color. It's good stuff. Mm. I like it. Then there is... Oh, no. Okay, so it was just those two. That's right. Sometimes they do, like, two variants, uh, two additional variants on the art. Uh, sometimes they don't. I guess they didn't this time. And this one, this is an autograph, is signed by Peter Jason, who played... Gilbert, or Gilbert, if you want to say it that way, if they shot in, like, French Canada or whatever, in the movie They Live. They Live, good, fun film. Oh, my gosh. Wow, this looks nice. Woo. Dude, look at this. It's like a mini poster. Look at how badass that looks. John Carpenter's They Live. Sorry, I'm trying to get the glare off as best I can. Look at this. Look at it. Look at it. Man, that looks really good. That looks, oh, that's such a badass. Ooh. Now, it's been a while since I've seen They Live. I actually own it. It's like back in here somewhere um, on DVD, just DVD. I own it. I'm, I like John Carpenter quite a bit. I like They Live. Live. It's a good movie. It's a fun movie. Um, it's been a while since I've seen it, though, so I don't know who this guy is. Actually, let me show you the picture of this guy. That's him. That's the guy. So I don't fully remember. I mean, he looks a little bit familiar, but I, like I said, it's been a while, so I don't really remember. But um, yeah, no, cool, cool nonetheless. To have something from They Live and how badass this looks. Oh my God, that looks, I'm very happy with that. That's really cool. So on the spoiler sheet, because that's what's left in the box. Um, so these are the different art or uh, autographs that you could have gotten. I'm very happy with the one that I got. They live, we sleep, obey, and then that one. So that one, so I guess this one's like the normal one. It's, um, yeah, because the out of 99 is the obey one, which is cool because of the reference in the movie, but I just think that the one I got just looks so good. And then you see like, you know, you already saw these. You already saw all those there and then what is the key from oh american horror story hotel 
Okay, it's a room key from American Horror Story Hotel. So I only watched the first season of American Horror Story, and then I um, just didn't go back to it. I do plan to at some point. I've heard mixed things about some of the seasons, so I don't know. But um, And then they have, they have in here, they've been doing golden ticket stuff. Um, so the instant winner, so they said, look for instant winner cards where you can win a free band box or an expansion pack. So that's something really cool they've been doing. If people want to see that, that's, that's down there. See. And then for their special giveaway, they were doing a Tim Curry signed Pennywise photo, which is amazing. That looks so good. I like how he signed the forehead. That looks, that looks wonderful. Whoever wins that, very lucky. Yeah, um, I like this. This is nice. It was nice that I got all the upgraded stuff. Love that. Thank you very much, Bambox, for that. That's amazing. Um, I especially like that I got all three pins because you know how I am with these pins. And so, obviously, my favorite things in here, this Frankenstein pin, which is really nice, and this autograph. <laughs> it just looks so good. It looks so good. And these are fun. Like, And obviously, they're timely because, you know... Oops, sorry, try not. Obviously, this is very timely with the new Halloween coming out very soon, so this is really cool. And actually, these would be really nice for me to display side by side because color versus not color. I like it. That's nice. It's really good stuff. I'm uh, going to give my uh, typical spiel real quick. Please hit the subscribe uh, button up there, and if you want to know whenever I'm putting new videos up, um, hit the little notification bell. Uh, put it down some comments down there we can geek out about stuff what do you think about what was in this box what do you think about the movies that these are from or in one case tv show um let's talk about that type of stuff like thumbs down up i don't doesn't matter to me whatever you want to do uh but please give me that subscribe it really does, it will help long run and it takes you like no time it's very very painless uh i do appreciate everyone checking this out uh, and yeah, um, look forward to the regular box for September, which should be in the next few days, and I'll post it as soon as I get it. But until next time, thank you, and keep it brutal.